Blackfoot, Sunday, April 16, 2023, 7.57 p.m. Once upon a time, there was a man named Yeoman, who lived in a small town nestled in the foothills of the Rocky Mountains. Yeoman was an avid outdoorsman who spent most of his free time hunting, fishing, and exploring the rugged wilderness surrounding his town. One day, while out on a hunting trip in a remote part of the forest, Yeoman stumbled upon a strange and unsettling sight. In a clearing ahead of him stood a creature unlike anything he had ever seen before. It was tall and covered in thick fur, with long arms that hung down to its knees and massive clawed feet. At first, Yeoman thought he had stumbled upon a bear or some other large predator. But as he watched, the creature stood up on its hind legs and began to walk upright. Yeoman was frozen in shock and amazement. He knew what he was looking at, Bigfoot. Despite his fear, Yeoman couldn't resist the opportunity to capture such a legendary creature. He quickly sprang into action, carefully stalking the creature and planning his strategy. For hours, he followed Bigfoot through the forest, biding his time and waiting for the perfect moment to strike. Finally, as the sun began to set, Yeoman saw his chance. Bigfoot had stopped to drink from a small stream and was completely engrossed in his task. Yeoman slowly crept up behind the creature, taking care not to make a sound. With a sudden burst of speed, Yeoman lunged forward and tackled Bigfoot to the ground. The creature struggled fiercely, but Yeoman was determined to hold on. He wrestled with Bigfoot for what felt like hours, his strength and resolve slowly dwindling. Just when Yeoman thought he couldn't hold on any longer, Bigfoot suddenly went limp. Yeoman cautiously got to his feet and looked down at the creature lying at his feet. He had done it he had captured Bigfoot. Yeoman was hailed as a hero in his town and beyond. People came from all over to see the legendary creature that had eluded capture for so long. Yeoman was offered millions of dollars for the rights to Bigfoot, but he refused them all. He knew that Bigfoot was too special to be locked away in a laboratory or zoo. Instead, Yeoman decided to release Bigfoot back into the wild, where he belonged. He knew that the creature would always be a mystery and a source of fascination for people. But he also knew that Bigfoot deserved to lie free and undisturbed. Years passed, and Yeoman grew old and eventually passed away. But his legacy lived on as people told the story of the man who captured Bigfoot with nothing but his own skill and determination. And somewhere out there, in the vast and untamed wilderness, Bigfoot still roamed free. A reminder of the power and wonder of the natural world.